It's just downright cool. 31 degrees in the city. It's 30 over in Terre Haute, 34 in Kokomo, and Muncie is at 38. But we have wind chill values that are in the upper 20s. It's going to stay that way over the next several hours. We talked about Purdue and IU, both home games out uh, uh, outside with those stronger winds this afternoon going to be chilly. This is at noon as we head into the next several hours. Temperatures will recover as we get back into the mid 40s for highs today. Now we might squeeze out a stray flurry, especially earlier on as temperatures are closer to freezing and then a stray rain shower possible getting into the afternoon. Here's that timeline as we walk you through about 9 o'clock this morning, this is when that boundary is going to scoot through the center, central uh, part of the state from Indianapolis to Muncie. Not going to rule out that potential of a stray shower, potentially a brief wintry mix for places like Newcastle, up through Delaware County, over to Richmond. But then as we warm back through the 40s this afternoon, any uh, little bit of moisture here is going to be all rain. So a stray shower possible through 5 p.m. This boundary is going to be long gone as we get into the later evening tonight. The sky slowly clears the temperatures will really drop again. So we'll go from the mid-40s at 6 p.m. through uh, 7 o'clock back into the upper 30s by 8, and then eventually temperatures falling back near freezing as we get into the overnight. We talked all about the daylight saving time ending. Uh, yeah, we're going to fall back one hour at 2 a.m., but meteorologically speaking, Changes in that sunrise and sunset will impact when we see our daytime highs and when we see our morning lows. New sunrise time is going to be at 7.15. Sun not expected to come up today until uh, just after 8.15. And then we see the sun setting a full hour earlier, so around 5.40. So we're going to see darkness a lot earlier after this time change takes place. And then we get into tomorrow, a chilly start in the upper 20s, but then tomorrow afternoon the wind will pick up out of the southwest and we'll actually see some warmer air in place as compared to today. Mostly clear start to tomorrow, very chilly though earlier on, becoming partly cloudy in the afternoon, but notice your temps here. A little warmer than today, that's why I'm going to go with Sunday, kind of the pick of the weekend, because it will be just slightly more mild. And then our next weather system, it's another cold front, going to set up for early Monday, going to bring in our next chance for a few stray showers, mainly Monday afternoon, here's 3 p.m., and then a series of kind of weak frontal boundaries going to push through during the first part of the week. That's going to be that reinforcing shot of cooler air going to keep our daytime highs really today through the end of next week below that seasonal average which is 59 for this time of year we'll go 50 for a high on tuesday and wednesday slight chance of a few stray showers on wednesday that next more widespread impactful weather system takes us to 46 thursday only 40 for a high next friday